guys, it's Friday, August 15th, and I'm taking over the vlog. I haven't edited the most recent videos yet, so I don't know how much Everett's told you, but he's going on vacation with his dad and he's gonna have a whole bunch of cool footage when he comes back. Um, for now, for about a week, I'm gonna be taking over the vlog, I'm gonna be talking to you guys, building a relationship with the 10 subscribers. Thank you very much for subscribing, by the way. You guys are my besties. I am so glad, and I hope it's not all my family, but if it is, that's cool too. Yay! I just realized that there's something I kind of want to mention to you guys. <laughs> I think it's pretty funny. Um, Everett has been trying to get me to remember the names of all of the Ninja Turtles. I, I used to watch it when I was a kid. I don't know if I had this problem, but now I find it very, very difficult to remember their names, and I think I figured out the problem. I think it's because I have this thing called synesthesia. I don't think I'm going to explain it very well, but it's when you associate one sensory experience or concept with another sensory experience or concept. So for example, um, I have a really hard time remembering that Michelangelo is orange because the name Raphael to me is orange. It's not like I see orange when I see the name, it's just that if I hear the name, I will just see orange in my head. It's just an orange name. If I think of the name, the name will be orange. And I think it's because, to me, the letter R is orange. So the same goes with the other Ninja Turtles too, like Michelangelo. The Angelo part of the name makes it red for me, so I always think that he's the red one. Um, Donatello. D is green. So, like, there's no green Ninja Turtle, they're all green. Um, and Leonardo is a yellow name. So yes, I am aware how crazy this makes me sound, but I think it's it's gotta be more common than, than you would think. I mean, when you're a kid and they're trying to teach you letters and numbers and you know when they have the, uh, the banners, I don't know, they had this in my school, the banners around the room that have all of the, the letters on it and they associate them with things and all of the letters are different colors. I don't know, that's gotta stick with some people, that that can't just be me. Um, it's, it's a crazy whole new world, well I shouldn't say crazy, it's not crazy, it's just, hey the brain's weird, it does weird things, I don't know, fucking magnets, how do they work? I don't know if you can see this, my neighbors have had this giant zucchini sitting on their table for about two weeks now, no no, maybe like three weeks. Why do you need that big of a zucchini just hanging around? Just eat it. Eat it! Make some fucking zucchini bread or something. Don't let that thing go to waste. It's a miracle of science. So right before Everett left, I've kind of been teasing him about a surprise that's gonna be happening when he gets back. I haven't told him what the surprise is, but I'll let you guys in on the secret. I'm gonna be painting our bathroom. I don't know how that exciting that is to you, but it's exciting to me. I'll show you why the official before shot of our bathroom. It's kind of dank. Kind of kind of dank place where dreams go to die. Um, the previous tenants were heavy, heavy smokers. So every time I wash the ceiling, the nicotine comes back and leaves stains. So that's cool. We also have a bit of a mold problem because we don't have a um, fan in the bathroom. And I don't have a shelf, so I got one of these. Um, anyone who has had one of these knows that if it gets off balance, everything flies everywhere. Which is... sucks. We got Betty. Um, Betty's been in the family for, uh... Sorry, this is getting too hot for Evie calling the daily, I'm sorry. Betty's been in the family for about three-ish years, and... I don't know, I'm thinking of retiring her. She kind of blocks the light a little bit. She's a small gal, but I need that window light. Thing. There's your official before shot of the bathroom. Let's go check out some paint colors. Yeah! Wait a minute, can we just talk about the fact that at 10 in the morning someone was stealing garbage out from under my neighbor's porch? There, we talked about it. I feel better now. Henry, which color do you like? Help me pick it up. It's kind of cloudy outside, so it's hard to see. Henry has chosen 
Life at Sea. It's actually a pretty good color. He has good taste. I think I was originally looking at Fountain Mist, but then I realized that there's a, where'd it go? Toronto Jays color. That's pretty cool. I might have to just pick it for the uh, novelty factor. It's about three in the morning now. I just got back home. I was hanging out with some people that uh, are in town and about to call it a night. I think Henry is too. So we'll see you tomorrow. Have a whale of a day.